Alrighty guys, I'm KC and welcome back to Nature's Beauty. And I just received a text. <laughs> but that's okay, we'll get to that later. It's probably just the bank saying, hey, you know what, you got this man and your money in your bank. You know, they always send me that text. But what I wanna do is I wanna I wanna go I wanna go exploring today. I wanna find a village. And mainly because I want to get into enchanting. I want to be able to get some books and we've already discussed the lack of animals there are so my best option is to go ahead and find a village and hopefully find some bookshelves in there there's tons of bookshelves in villages now with the uh, mods that's in this pack but uh, i just wanted to show that i've done this look i do want to push this back one i think this would look better if we pushed it back one but now i'm looking at it with fresh eyes i'm not so sure i guess we'll fix it for that i did go ahead and i brought the green site all inside and i did do it Partly up here, but I ran out of green slate. I need to go and do some mining, uh, which we'll get to at some point. I do like the way this sort of like is just down a level and all. Like, I do need to sort that block out there and sort that out there. There are a couple of things that I need to sort out, but I've moved all the stuff over here, got us all settled out. And one thing that I want to do is sort out a map. And there's this thing called Atlas, okay? Which is a book and a compass. So I need one leather, three... Um, one leather and three paper, which isn't that odd. I've got a small sugar cane farm going out here. Uh, nothing major, but it is something. We've got three there, that'll do. Can you make paper shapelessly in, in this? No. It actually requires a crafting table. Okay, I wasn't sure. So there we go, there's paper, and there's the book. So we got the book, and now we need a compass, which is... I can remember if this is four pieces of redstone or four pieces of iron. Um, let's have a little look. Nope, it's four pieces of iron. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. There we go. So we put this compass and this book together, and we get this empty antique map. And it, it, I like this map, I really do, I think it's really cool, but it shows us here. Now, add marker where we are now. Village, if I can spell village, mine. Um, what do we have? Done. So now on our map, I can see where our mine is. That doesn't stand out all that well, does it? Like, that kind of blends in. That's, um, um, delete marker. Let's add another marker. Um, is there, like, anything that really stands out? We'll just do this one because it's, like, it's red. And I can see that that stands out a lot more. That stands out a lot better. So I want to find a village. And we may have to go exploring some distance to find one but that's okay that's okay that's okay now the question is which way do we want to go this that way is north which we've been we've been north so i think hey look at that on the map is that a village like we're looking here on the map or is that just trees i can't tell if they're like houses or trees let's go and have a little look i bet they're just trees i bet they're just trees yeah, it looks to be just trees. But that's okay, that's okay. I do have everything that I need on me, I believe. Could have done with a better axe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to go back and make an axe. So I'm going to go back, I'm going to make an axe. And I'm going to do a little bit of exploring. I'll bring you back when I've got something to show. Well, I haven't come across the village, but I have found this structure. I found a couple of other structures along the way, but they've mainly just been like rock piles like that. Didn't really warrant showing, but this one, you come in here and it goes down. Okay, it looks like it's got two spiraling staircases and all. Uh, I also got some more grape seeds. <laughs> Not that they're important, but uh, ooh. there is mossy cobble down here, which is good because actually we need this. Let's grab it. I do have a couple of mobs. There's a slime block. Block. Okay. I think we should take this out of our offhand and put the torches in our offhand. There's two ways to go. There's a spawner there. So let's grab that. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, there's cave spiders. It's cave spiders. And they came out with a passion. With a burning, fiery passion. Okay. There's some sort of like mausoleum. I oh, know this is one thing that I am actually looking forward to in this pack. Lots of reasons to explore. Got that. 
Is there anything like in here? No, it's just it's just obsidian, and I don't have a I don't have a diamond pick. So I'm not gonna worry too much about it. It's not like obsidian's that hard to get anyway. Random stuff. Still no loot yet. Still no loot. I want to finish checking this room. See if there's anything in here. Nope. Grab that. Grab that. I should probably be breaking them with shears. So that I can actually get them. That goes down. I'm not sure that I want to go down yet. Probably with the best loot's at the bottom. That would make sense. But there's a spawner there. Is that a cave spider spawner? Okay, well at least I don't think it can spawn anything because I think I've got all the spawnable areas lit up. And the thing is, we should have brought some diamond chest transporters with us. Do you know what the, the smart thing would be to do? Okay, if I was really smart, I wouldn't be stood here with only half health. I would grab a marker, I would add it, and we'd go... Nope, can I spell spawner, please? Because there are diamond chest transporters, which means I can bring spawners back and I can make a mob farm. A really good one, actually, that doubles up as an XP farm quite easily. So maybe that's something we'll do in the future. But, actually, that's probably something we'll do relatively soon. Okay. Let's eat some berries. The one thing I hate about when you've got torches in your hand, if you eat, you end up placing a bunch of them by accident. Okay. Wow, there's a couple up there. I better be careful. I don't want to die this far from home. Here we go. Let's just eat. See what I mean? Play torches. This drives me crazy. Oops. That is still spawning them somehow. Let's eat. Okay, you know what? We don't really need to go that way. Let's go down. Which leads back up. I swear, I stuck at finding good things. I really do. Like we've not, we've been in here and we've found a loot. We've, we had that that mine shaft. We had no loot, or very little loot. Running low on torches. Okay. Nothing there. That's fine. I do have a couple of pieces of coal on me, and a couple of logs. So we can make. A few more torches. Only eight more, but... It's something. Actually, it is. We don't need that torch there. Okay. These berries really do not last long at all. But they're only berries. They're not supposed to. We do need to get into a better food source at some point. Okay. No loot. If I just come down here for, like, nothing, I just saw a chest there. Let's open this up into a cave. I'm not going cave exploring. But I did see that chest. Ooh. Was it this chest? You little monkey. How dare you? Just how dare you? Okay. So gentle. I don't think we're going to bother reading that. I would like to find some leather. Leather would make my day. I didn't even bring shears with me, by the way, in case we found sheep. So here's some more loot. Uh, nothing really all that big. But, but, having said that, that is big. Coal. That means we can make ourselves some more torches. And I know you can find ancient tomes to put on your items and stuff. Hey, zombie, just chill, man, just chill. We're, we're, we're all friends. Well, we are until I've killed you, like. Hey, I'm just killing your friend and you come in a time. I mean, what kind of friend are you? I'm trying to save him from the blood-eating cravings of a zombie. And you, and I just, I just allow this zombie to get free. Okay, that's good. And there's no chest underneath there, okay. We got another couple of chests here. Finally, some loot. What we got here? Okay, so we need to put some stuff away. So, I know I wanted the cobblestone, but I can make it. Same with this. 
grape seeds and actually no i don't have oak tree we can put that away we can put that away we can put we'll keep the sticks we'll keep that i don't really need these or do i let's, let's, have, let's have a read of them okay they never pull the locks nor the lips with horror why do the kisses seek hostile so barely embrace Okay, so I was wondering if they might, like, contain some sort of, like, hidden message, like, coordinates for another place that we can go and raid. But I'm guessing not. I don't really want the spider eye. I can get bones because we've got a skeleton farm. Or at least we've got a skeleton spawner near us. We'll grab these. I need the books. Oh. These books are named. Why would you name a book just to ruin my life? No. Okay, at least we're getting a lot. We're getting a lot of loot now. I was complaining the loot was terrible. Okay. I do want to grab the slime box. Because slime is something that we don't actually have access to. I can't think of a reason we'd need slime other than the sticky pistons. And I'm not much of a redstone guy, so... But, that being said... It's right here, you know. Literally right here. There's no reason not to grab it. Like, no reason whatsoever. Because we, we may need it. We may need it. We don't know why we'd need it. But we may need it. Okay. Let's see if there's any more loot. Da -da -da -da. Oh, we checked this chest, didn't we? Yes, that's where we put stuff. Okay, so there's no loot there. But I feel like we didn't fully explore that area where there's... Yeah, this area, look. Because there's this other slime block here. Okay. Nope. So I think that's the most part of this. So I think I'm going to get back to get into the surface. We'll go out this way. No, we won't go out this way. Where was that? I'm sure there was like a little area here. Yes. What is it with these corners? Spiders seem to love them. Oh, hello. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Oh, no. This is this is really bad. Nope. Okay, okay, okay. Eat. Eat. Far half a heart. This isn't good. Can I heart beating? That is kind of cool, though, that you can eat heart beating. Okay. So I think I'm going to get out of here because there's no reason to be in here. I'll grab this atlas. And I'll catch you back when I find another thing to explore. See you in a moment. Oh, well, welcome back. And I found this little hole here. Uh, and I think there's a spawner there. I think. So we're going to try our best. I did find another skeleton spawner. Not another skeleton spawner, sorry. A spider spawner. Uh, but it's literally right on the surface. I didn't really warrant you bringing you back. Uh, I could probably survive that. But I think I'd rather... I'd rather not risk it, you know? So I am curious what this is. I wish I'd have brought a diamond chest for a supposer with me. Okay. This might not be a spawner. This might just be some sort of um, structure. But it's still something to explore. I might have to break exploring down into two episodes. If I... Yes, I could drop in the here. Let's get rid of you. And this will break my fall. Let's get rid of you. Okay. Let's make ourselves some torches. And... Yeah. Okay. Nope. So there are some gems here, but I'm not going to worry about them too much. I'm looking for, like, chests or something. But this looked promising. This looked really promising. But I'm guessing it's just, like, a little structure. I mean, does it continue anywhere? It continues down there. Sort of. <laughs> yeah, I don't really think this is anything. Although, I can get rid of some stuff here. I don't really, really want the spider highs. I can get a ton of limestone. I'm trying to conserve our resources. I'm trying to think of the stuff that I can get. I don't need the oak wood because I've got that. Actually, I could have used the oak wood now. I think about it. Um, yeah. Okay. 
So it looks like I gotta get back to the surface. Which I shouldn't imagine would be too hard. I mean, it is right there. Ooh, that's a bad place to be. Get back to the surface when you threw every block you had into the bloody floor. Oh, what's that? Chalk dust. What can we use that for? Okay, so it just makes this chalk block. Or you can smelt it to make quick lime. And this can be used to make sleek slime. Lime plaster, which, what can this be used for? Okay, this can be used for, for a wide array of stuff. I'm betting I can find this, though, easily. I'm betting it's not as difficult as it looks. Okay. Let's grab some blocks. I bet if we got, um, I bet if we got, like, silk touch, we could grab the actual blocks. Okay. Let's grab the marble. That really looks promising. It really did. I was hoping for something. I'm still trying to find that village. So yeah, I'm gonna get back on that. It's driving me crazy. Every time I eat and I finish eating, I end up pulling out the map. It's driving me crazy. Ah, oh, it really does drive you crazy, guys. Catch you back in a bit. Okay, I've seen a couple of things along the way, but this one I just wanted to share with you. Oh, and there's one of these. No, I'll show you one of these as well. I've been finding a couple of these around, right? And they've got iron ore in the side, but they have a lot of iron ore inside them. Like, a lot. I found a couple of these along the ways. But yeah, I also found some ice. I don't really want this andesite. I should say that, but I'm, I'm actually going after andesite in my single player survival world at the minute. Uh, because I've got an idea for my mind in that, and I need some of this. <laughs> Shame you can't transfer them over to world. But yeah, this is what I saw, and I just thought this looked cool. This pumpkin here. I don't know if there's anything inside of it. Um, but I suppose it can't hurt to break inside. But yeah, there is stuff inside, but it doesn't seem like there's much of anything of use inside. I'm not seeing, like, any chests or anything. Nope. I mean, we could take a couple of pumpkins, but I am low on... I just wonder if there is any other way in the pack to get leather. Of course, there's rabbit hide. Um, okay, so we can do it using this. Okay, which that is relatively cheap. And we do that in what? A ground trap? Or maybe that's what I've got to... Maybe I catch something in it. Maybe we'll have to get into that for leather if I can't find a village. Because I have been looking for some time. And I haven't found a village, so maybe we should lay some of those traps around our base. Yeah, that'd be quite cool. It's not something that everybody else is doing. Oh, what's that? Is this a village? Yeah, I don't think it is, but it is something. It's definitely a structure of some sort. Oh, it's a bit framey over here, look. It's really kind of framey here. Okay. Anything upstairs, I suppose. I suppose we gotta look. We can sort of see out. This is a nice watchtower. So it's supposed to be like a bell in the bell tower. Okay. Let's see. Is there anything else like down below? Can we go downstairs in here? No. Okay, whatever this is, it is causing me some frame rate issues. But I don't, I don't think it's anything other than just a really nice structure to look at. Ooh, there's something over there, like a little house. There's another one of these, but to be honest, I've got enough iron at this point. Well, okay, there's one. Well, there's a couple, but I've got like 48. We've got the pulvis, you know. This looks like a village. Maybe not a vanilla village. But it's definitely a village of sorts. Okay. Um, let's put this terracotta down. Um, okay, let's get rid of some stuff. I don't need this. Um, get rid of the poppy. We can munch on the apples. Get the, get this food down first. 
because I do want to take... What? Oh, is this inhabited by witches? Evidently so. Okay, okay. Kill witches first. Do not die to witches. This must be an abandoned village because of witches. I bet there's witch spawners hidden somewhere as well. Come on, don't die. Don't die. Please don't die. I don't want to die. I don't want to go. Okay. We got to damage Danville. Grab that. Grab that and that. Okay. I don't really need the mushrooms per se, do I? But one thing I've never tried in Minecraft is can you combine the anvils? No. But they're anvils that we don't have to worry about. I don't really care for that. I'll take that. Okay. Now, witches, please be nice and have a library somewhere. Have somewhere that you store books. You have a cave. You have a... Aha! Aha! A chest! Okay. So we'll take that. Um... I'm going to put these books away because they're not... Well, realistically, we're probably not going to use them. Um, grab that. I don't have any bones, so I'm not going to grab the bones. Put the dirt away. I'm going to put the redstone back because I'll get a ton of redstone over the course of this game. So, let's grab those books. Okay. I want to kill Bambi just to see if they drop thingy, but they run away from you. And then when they run away, I feel guilty. Okay, that's cool. That's a cool like, little addition. Uh, we got another bookcase up here. Okay. Another one here. Um, anything underneath the floor? No, this is actually wall, not thingy. Okay. Alright. Does seem a little bit of a high house with the top cut off, though. Can we see anything in that window? No, no, no. Looks like we're okay. Okay. Another one of these. Oh, this is a little bit different. Ooh. Curse of Vanishing. Bane of Anthropods 5. Grey Rune. I don't know what these Grey Runes are. But it can't hurt to take it. Okay, I'm not going to take Curse of Vanishing because honestly I have absolutely no use of Curse of Vanishing. I don't know why I'd have it. I'm trying to reserve inventory space. So. Okay, so we've got another one of these. Nothing else in here. Okay, we take those. I've got I've got access to all of this stuff. We'll take that bread. Because why not? Okay. Let's grab a marker. Let's put a marker where we are. Which village? Okay. Which village is the right witch? That actual vibe is a little bit different. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else has ever come up with that diddy, but uh, it's not family friendly, so I'm just going to... Um, do you, like, hide anything at the bottom of your well? Nope. I swear it's like I'm eating every two seconds of this mod pack. Don't know if that's intentional or accidental. We, we checked in there, didn't we? Yes. Okay. Ooh. Some sugar. We got some wheat farm going on over here, but don't really want that. Okay, is there anything that I haven't seen? Little bit thingy that this actually didn't show up as a village on the map. I've been looking on the map for a village, and now I'm beginning to think maybe I missed one. Okay. So I think I'm going to get back to looking for some more structures. Yeah, and I'll bring you back if I find some sort of, found some sort of other structure that looks like another abandoned village. And I thought we'd check this out together. Only really, very, very small, but maybe it's in a... Actually, you know what? This reminds me of an abandoned railway station. Um, oh, bit of lag. I guess it's because I'm just laboring in new chunks. Okay. So I thought about playing with shaders, but there are a couple of reasons that I'm not playing with shaders. Okay, the first reason is because I've never played with shaders before, ever in Minecraft. 
And I, I don't know which ones to go with. I don't know which ones to go with, which ones not to go with. And when I watch people play with shaders, I always get a bit of a headache after a couple of videos. So I have to take a break. So. And then she put a torch there, but that's okay. Okay, is there anything I don't want? Um, I suppose we can get rid of the one piece of that. We get rid of the sticks as well, because I'd like the golden apple and the iron helmet. And I would like these books. We need 45 books for the enchanted table. We got 12. Okay. So this is a zombie spawner. Which you can't really think of a use for. But it's good to know it exists. At least if we do need it, I know where to come for it. Okay. Oh, wow. I have not been this framey at all. <laughs> While adventuring, so I come into this forest. But the first world that I played, I don't know if I've told you about the first world that I played. Uh, I played this pack with the intention of recording it. I played the first episode and it was very laggy. Uh, and I was in a forest like this, so I think it's something to do with the foliage or something in these areas. I was about to press F3 to bring up my map, but we are just north of our position now. Uh, I've kind of, you can see on the map the, the route that I've taken. I've gone sort of like round in a big circle. Uh, so I, I'm going to have to expand my horizons but I think that we want to venture up into this desert here I think this might be a good place to find a village uh, let me get my bed I put my bed down somewhere and I didn't pick it up oh that's not good <laughs> we could always go out to the zombie base for a bed yeah I do have the string to make a bed um, is that spider coming for us? That spider looked like it was coming for us. Okay, let's just sit here and chill. Those zombies are, but they've got an they've got an exceptionally large. Yeah, literally home is right in this direction. So I guess I'll okay, we're home away in the sleeping bliss of dreamland. But now we're back. And what I want to do is I wanna I wanna do a couple of things to finish off the episode, okay? The first thing that I want to do is fill up our pulvers. I mean we've got this thing here. I want to do it. Okay, so the first thing that I want to do is I want to go ahead and I want to create what's called a backpack. Now, if you've not used one of these before in any mod pack, I don't know what you've been doing, man. They're, they're, they're as useful as anything. They really, really are, and I make them in almost every pack that I play, or I make something similar. So the backpack is this thing, okay? And it's made the chest for leather and wool. Now, I got this leather from killing horses. I found a lot of horses, but not a lot of other animals. Okay, now, unfortunately, this backpack only has room for two rows of, what is that, nine items? Yes. But never fear, for I believe we can upgrade her. Nope, is that not it? Okay, I know it's iron somehow. Ah, it requires another chest. That's fine. This one, and now we now have four rows. That's a little over a single chest. But again, we can go up to gold. Okay. So yeah, yeah, up to gold. And this is now a double chest, which is good because it means we can store a lot more items. And I want I put the chicken in there to see if it carried over the items that it got. And it looks like it does, so let's put some of these away. Uh, yeah. Okay, mob drops. We'll put the slime in there because slime are technically mob drops, really, aren't they? Um, my That goes there. That can go in there. Ish and tone, that's good to have. What was this one? Reading. I still don't know what reading does. Still not a clip. So, let's put those away. Put the chalk in there. And the grey rune. I don't know. Can I right-click this grey rune? No. Okay, let's have a little look. See if it's craftable in any way. No. Okay, what about if I were to try to combine it in an anvil? Nope. What about sword? Nope. Axe? Nope. Okay, so I can't combine the Grey Rune, and I don't know what... It doesn't say what mod it's from. Can I place it down in the world like a... Uh... Nope. Okay, I have no idea what this Grey Rune is for. We've got a couple of anvils, which is actually pretty good, because that way we can save our iron, because these cost a lot. But yeah, so I think that's going to call it for this episode. I made up the backpack that I want to do. I think in the next episode we're going to get into some bear traps around here. I'm 
quite possibly finish off our little base, our little mine here, because this is not that good. I mean, I like it, but I, I would like to get some other details worked into this wall. We could even do just a, a brief bit now, because like, I didn't put anything here because I wanted to put logs here. You know, and the same on this side. Just to add some more, like, detail to this. And I think we could go with, like, logs here. And then maybe here. Yeah, I'm not opposed to that. That looks pretty good. Um, this is one where I'm going to have to go up there. Unfortunately, I don't have any green slate to finish off the, um, the ceiling just yet. And I do not have enough mossy cobble to, to do the rest of it. But even just adding that sort of makes it feel like we are in a jungle. Yeah, I, I kind of like this. I'm trying to go with like an Indiana Jones theme. And I've never seen Indiana Jones. But uh, I just realised that needs to go there. Okay. So I think between episodes I got a lot of mining to do. This backpack is going to mean that I don't have to make as many trips up and down as I would have to otherwise. Uh, let's put this... Actually, this cobble can go away where it's supposed to go. So yeah, I've got a little bunch of these stuff here. I'm trying to think of the stuff we'd get from actually being down in our mine to put up here. Oops. As opposed to what we'd get from just randomly chopping wood down. So I'm trying to keep wood out of here. But I don't know what to do with uh, these. Because we get these bricks from these slates. But we also get other things. So what I'm thinking is... I, I'm, I think there's only four slates. Let's have a little look. There is only four slates, yeah. We've got the blue, the green, the purple. And I know we've got a black slate. We've got two different types of black slates. So we've only got three. If we've only got three. This is from Earthworks, isn't it? This slate. Because this doesn't make the bricks. Then we could do them going across like that with the different areas. That would make sense. And I could put this, this slate... As this slate doesn't match this slate, it's different over here. Because we've only got the blue, the green, and the purple lock. You know. And what we could do is we could do that with the brick firm, which I think I'll use. And then we'll do a four draw for the other ones or something. Yeah. All right, and well, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. So if you have enjoyed the video, I'm not sure about that block there. Please do consider leaving a like. It really helps out the channel. I really do appreciate it. So please do leave a like. And click subscribe if you want to see more from me, guys. I'm Casey. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.